Welcome to the Needs Assessment Unit's convenient online service to apply for financial assistance. To make this service quick and easy, please have digital copies readily available of the following. A photo identification, proof of income and savings if applicable, in the form of pay slip, job letter, bank statements, as well as utility bills, lease agreements, invoices, etc. as proof of expenses. If all you have are paper copies, you can have them scanned or use a mobile device like a tablet or cell phone to take a clear photo of the entire document before or while completing the application form. For your convenience, you can save partially completed applications. So if necessary, you can save your progress and resume at your convenience. To get started, visit the NAU website, nau.gov.ky and click apply on the top menu. When completing the application form, there are other important points to note. You can complete the online application form in one session or save your progress and continue later. To save and continue, you will need to provide a phone number that can receive a text SMS message. Be sure to write down your application code as you will need it to retrieve the information you entered. When completing the online application form, there is a guidelines button that can be used to access instructions for completing and submitting the form. The form will work on a cell phone, tablet, or computer. Whenever you see a red asterisk or star, that information is required before you can submit your application form. To complete your application, there are seven steps. These are displayed at the top of the application form and the blue circle will show where you are right now. Enter the requested data in all fields. Step one, eligibility. This section covers key questions that determine if the applicant, the person who is seeking financial assistance, qualifies to be considered for financial assistance from the Needs Assessment Unit. Persons who are Caymanian or who are dependents of a Caymanian with a monthly household net income of CI $3,000 or less after pension and health deductions and who have no other available funds, savings of CI $3,000 or less if age 18 to 64, or CI $8,000 or less if age 65 or older and or permanently disabled. Please answer all the questions on this page. Once you are finished answering the questions, click Save and go to Next Step button. Step 2. Personal Details This section requires personal details about the person who is seeking financial assistance, the applicant, and their spouse or live-in partner. Please complete all mandatory and relevant fields on this page. Relevant fields are noted with an asterisk or star. Starting with the applicant, this includes all names, including maiden name if applicable. If you have an alias or nickname you go by, provide this in the other names box. In this step, you will also provide phone numbers. When doing so, you should first select whether you are entering a cell, home, or work number, then enter the 10 digit phone number, including the 1345 area code, and then click on the green plus sign. Once the number is a valid telephone number, it will be accepted by the form. If the applicant has a live-in partner, supply information about them in the section at the bottom of the page. Once all the information is entered, this section is complete. You can now save and continue later or save and go to the next step. Step three, household occupants. In this section, provide details about all other persons living in the household and their relationship to the person who is applying for financial assistance. For example, your children, grandchildren, brothers, sisters, roommates. If there is no other person living in the household, click no, and then click save and continue to next section. If there are additional persons in the household, please select yes and enter the details required for each person. To provide information on the additional persons living in the household, enter the details of one person, then click the green add occupant button. 
To add multiple persons, once the information appears in the table at the bottom of the page, enter the details for next person in the field above and then press the green Add Occupant button. Follow this same process to add multiple persons. Step 4. Monthly Income and Savings In order to make an informed decision, the NAU needs to be aware of any money received as income or from investments such as dividends as also savings and investments like fixed deposits. Note, if you do not have any source of income or savings, click the Save and Continue to Next Section button at the bottom of the page. Otherwise, a table of income is displayed for you to input information in the sections that are applicable. To enter information for the items that are applicable, select the checkbox on the left, then enter the amount and the source or payer of that income. The total amount will be automatically calculated and displayed at the bottom of the table. Section 5. Monthly Expense In this section, you are required to provide information pertaining to the monthly expenses and assets, example, house, car, savings, and liabilities, example, loans, credit cards, mortgage, of the person applying for financial assistance from the NEU and all other adults in the applicant's household. A table of possible expenses, assets and liabilities is displayed for you to input information in the sections that are applicable. To provide information for the items that are applicable, select the checkbox in the left, then enter the amount and the source or payee of that. The total amount will be automatically calculated and displayed at the bottom of the table. Note, if you do not have any assets or liabilities, complete the expense section and leave the assets and liabilities section blank. Detail guidance about the supporting documents that will be required for upload in the subsequent step, depending on the information provided, is outlined in the gray informational box at the top of the page. Step 6. Required Documents In this section, you will need to supply digital copies of documents such as personal identification, utility bills, mortgage statement or rent lease agreement, pay slip, job letter, maintenance statement, etc. You can upload these as photos or PDFs. To upload a document, simply choose the document type from the drop-down list, then click on the word Choose then select the appropriate document to be uploaded. To add multiple documents in the same category, click on the green plus sign and follow the same steps. If you have partially completed the form but need more time to finish, as mentioned earlier, you can save the incomplete application, then continue at another time. To do so, you must provide a mobile phone number you will have access to when you want to retrieve it later. Before exiting, ensure that you write down or take a picture of the application code and keep it secure as you will need this to retrieve the incomplete application. Please keep this application code safe. When you are ready to resume the application, go to nau.gov.ky and click Retrieve. Enter your application code and click Get Security Code. Once you have received your security code, enter it on the screen and continue the process. When you have completed all six sections of the form with the required information, you will be presented with the option to either review your application details by clicking on the Review Application button, or if you believe that all the information entered in the form is accurate, you can proceed to the submission stage by clicking the Submit Application button. When reviewing the form, all the information that you supplied will be displayed on the screen for you to review it. If anything is incorrect, you can return to that section and make changes by clicking on the Edit button. Otherwise, proceed to Step 6, then click Submit Application button to finalize the process. In the final Section 7, which will only appear when you indicate that you are ready to submit your application, please indicate if you wish for NAU to share information relating to your application for financial assistance with someone else. 
If you so desire, provide the details of that authorized person. Finally, please ensure that you read through the agreements at the end and tick all the boxes to acknowledge that you have read them and are in agreement. You will also need to add your signature at the end before submitting. You can use your finger to sign in the box if you are using a mobile device, a mouse if you are using a computer, or a touchpad if you are using a laptop. After saving your signature, the submit button will activate. You are now able to submit your application form to the NEU for review. If you do not click submit, NEU will not receive the application and therefore will not be able to review your request. Click the submit button and your information will be submitted directly to the needs assessment unit for processing. Upon reviewing, the NEU will be able to confirm if you are eligible for financial assistance or reach out for more information. You should write down and keep the unique application number safe to facilitate ease of future interactions with NEU. If you are having trouble with your application, please email us at neuinfo at gov.ky.